Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Thank you all for clicking on this video. If you are new, my name is Stephanie and welcome to I'll Buy the Popcorn. Today, finally, I know it's been like two or three days that the trailer came out, but we're going to be doing the first impressions on the new Charlie's Angels. All right, let's get to it. I think women can do anything. Just because they can, doesn't mean they should. <laughs> there have so many talents. It's like I'm powerful. That's just the way you make me feel. Outstanding angels. You have the new client? Who is she? I can't sleep at night. I'm the lead programmer on a product that can revolutionize the power industry. But there is a possibility it can be weaponized. Elena, we need to go. Charlie's pose there towards the end. Straight off the bat, I gotta say, I'm kind of digging Kristen Stewart in this. No normally, I'm not that fond of her. I mean, I've seen a lot of her stuff. I mean, I love, I was like a big like Twilight fan. I, I, you couldn't talk shit about Twilight. Even like in a lot of movies that she's done, even like, you know, Snow White in The Huntsman, where she was Joan Jett, Panic Room. I don't really see like the character she's supposed to be portraying it's almost like i still see krista in this one it actually seems like she's actually having fun and really like taking on this this role i'm excited to see how she's gonna be throughout the whole film because i don't know this easily could have been like her best scenes that they did just to kind of catch her eye and it could have been just the regular kristen stewart that we all know but from what i got here in the trailer i i'm i'm digging it elizabeth banks is a director and also a producer and i believe i heard that maybe she wrote or helped write it or maybe has something to do which i guess is why she made herself bothly and i know that we're like in an age where we're trying to get more female roles and like powerhouse roles and feminism and everything like i'm for it but there's certain parts that i feel that maybe should have they, like as they were. Bossy is basically like the sidekick assistant decoy you know it's funny and witty and I just don't know how Elizabeth Banks is going to play Bossy because that's, this is a Bossy that I know because Bill Murray and also Bernie Mac both portrayed Bossy in almost the same kind of aspect. I didn't really get that when I saw the preview. I feel like she's gonna be more like kind of like straightforward. I'm sure she's gonna have some witty remarks but probably more on a serious tone than just kind of carefree i just i don't know i don't know i mean i love elizabeth banks if she was part of the writing 
crew I think maybe she should have been like the villain and they should have just left falsely as a guy and honestly i didn't know that they were doing a sequel to charlie's angels i found out there there was bosley to me honestly should have been Shia LaBeouf. I know he's still young and I think he might actually be older than you know the the girls there about the same age but ultimately it's not really gonna matter just because he has the experience because he's been a Bosley since he was a teenager so he's had that training where he could easily be their Bosley and I think that would have been like awesome for this to have brought him back in here. I'm sure he just didn't want to do it because you know Shia LaBeouf is kind of like all above. Naomi Scott's really been killing it within these past few years. I mean, she was the Pink Ranger, which, you know, she's being paired up back with Elizabeth Banks. And then, of course, she was Princess Jasmine. Now she's going to be an angel. So she's really picking her roles really well. Ella Balinska? Is that how you pronounce her name? I know I'm horrible with names. I really don't know where I've seen her before. I don't know if she's like a newer actress or she's just really done like smaller a role that she's not very well known but i'm sure if this movie comes out to be like huge then we're gonna know who she is one thing that i did notice though was that it seems that they're not all three gonna know each other so it looks like uh, naomi's character um gets added on to the angels later on so that's something new i don't know how well that's gonna go because you know they're like a trio they're like a sisterhood i mean obviously they're gonna get close as the film goes on but you know there's always going to be that well these two have been there longer so they're like more closer than her character so that's interesting to see that how that's going to play out thought it was going to be like a reboot but you know no, they straight off the bat they did have different uh names and from what i understand um, that it is just kind of like a sequel just like the new generation angels so i am looking forward to seeing this that's it i hope you guys enjoyed this don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet don't forget to hit that notification bell so you'll be notified each time uh, I post something new. Go ahead and let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about this movie. Are you guys looking forward to it? Are you going to pass on it? What do you think of the new angels? Are you in agreement with Bosley? Like, should they have left Bosley as a guy? Are you looking forward for Elizabeth Banks to be Bosley? Because, you know, like, woohoo, girl power. Do you guys think maybe Shia should have came back to be Bosley? Or are you just, like, hating Shia LaBeouf? Because I know a lot of people just hate him now. But... Let me know down below what you guys thought. And until next time, I'll be seeing you at concessions. Bye.